Hi everyone, I already started my walk today. I'm at the beach again. I've decided to do like a weekly beach theme because it's so beautiful out. Da, 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 da. So Dave is filming me again. Thank you. So you guys have been asking me a lot of questions. I'm gonna answer another one today. This one is about cheating. <laughs> of course, that could be interpreted many different ways. But the question is, do I cheat? And what this person means is, do I cheat on my diet? Because I'm currently um, eating all organic, all vegan, and I've been doing this for about four years. Long story short, when I was first diagnosed and I was really, really, really unwell, and I was in congestive heart failure, um, the um, idea of cheating, the idea of essentially eating anything that I didn't think was good for me, was so far removed from my mind because, of course, all that I was thinking about and all that I still am thinking about is getting better. But I will say this, ah, when my pulmonary pressures went down from 180 to 32, I got very excited and I decided that I was going to try dark chocolate, which happens to be my greatest joy of life is eating dark chocolate. I brought dark chocolate back into my life and I tried to see if I could get away with it and truthfully, I could not. And I'm guessing it's the caffeine in it, there's something in it that unfortunately I'm not ready to absorb because I felt much worse um, over time, of course. So I then had to stop eating it because I'm the one making the rules for myself, so cheating on them wouldn't really serve anyone. Do I get tempted to cheat? Yes. And I get tempted to cheat when I feel better. So when I feel worse, I'm not tempted. When I feel better, I am. But truthfully, chocolate is really the thing that, that uh, is the hardest for me to stay away from. Chocolate and coffee, I'd say. almost done with the walk um, but I wanted to say one more thing which is that I really believe it's all about making a decision you know with regard to cheating and not cheating at least for me it's so much about making an official decision because I know that I can have chocolate around the house and whatever around the house but if I've decided I'm not gonna have it then I'm not gonna have it and if I have not decided that then I will be tempted and chances are I will have it um, Dave who's filming right now follows a paleo diet, paleo lifestyle, essentially is eating meat all the time and lots of times I'm actually cooking it. And the only reason I'm not tempted, though it smells very good, but the only reason I'm not tempted is because I've made a decision. Done. Punto final. We're almost at six minutes. And... Wait. Stop. Da -da -da. We're done for the day, everyone. So I will see you tomorrow. I hope you're enjoying these videos. Uh, if you're on YouTube, don't forget to click thumbs up and subscribe, it really helps. If you're on Facebook, leave me comments down below. Let me know if there's anywhere you want me to go and walk around in LA, and I will do my best to go there. And now it's time for me to find a ladies room because I had a lot of water, and that is a problem when you go to the beach and see water and have no bathroom.